Hi everyone, Alex Murray coming right back at you with another tutorial here. We're going to be talking today about a potential fix for a Steam launching issue with OOTP22. Occasionally people have come to us in our tech support ticket system asking how they can get past an app framework error that happens on Steam. This usually is a problem because of the fact that they have either attempted to put the game on an external hard drive that may have changed location, or on a drive that may not give them full permissions. Some people have also reported this happens depending upon whether or not their Steam is on an external hard drive, and sometimes that can cause issues. This can be fixed a couple different ways. Um, there are a ch There is a chance that you could actually add permissions to your Steam or the game to launch correctly. You can run it as administrator, and that would be an instant fix potentially. But we want to demonstrate today how to get past that issue by simply deleting a couple of files from your computer to see if you can get past this issue. Most of the time, the app framework error is accompanied by a crash on startup error. So we're going to tackle that first, and then hopefully that will resolve your issue. And we're doing this tutorial for one person in particular who asked for this video. So we're going to start off by demonstrating that. Now, there are two ways to go about doing this fix. So let me go ahead and get you guys set up with this other page here. There we go. So the files that we need to locate are going to be in your config folder which is part of your app data which is a hidden folder on windows now for mac it is a company directly where the game is installed to with your file system um, which normally is i believe applications mac has been changed a few times so it should be applications um but we'll have a different way to find those for you Mac users, so hold on tight. I'll get to you guys in a second. For Windows, however, you can either find this file location manually or by simply using the OOTP program itself. I will demonstrate how to do both, just in case you guys want to be able to see both done in action. Now, your app data location is going to be underneath your local C drive or whatever local drive you're using to launch your Windows in. It'll be underneath of users, it'll be underneath of your username, and then it'll be underneath of app data. And app data is a hidden folder. If you don't see that app data folder, you can go to view and make sure your hidden items is checked on for your uh, for your computer. That'll allow you to find that. Underneath of roaming, out of the park developments, and then OOTP22, you will find the config folder. Now, for some users, the app framework error happens either at launch because of Steam and an issue that Steam has with the location the game is trying to pull files from and save files to. That's usually what happens is a lot of people try to change the location of where they want the game to save their, their, um, their saved games or the data folder, and sometimes that can cause that issue. Steam can sometimes have that issue if it doesn't like where you have it set up to send files to for the game. Now, that's normally a very expert type thing where you've changed something or you're trying to force the game to use, 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 to, sorry, use a different folder. Now, the way that we go about changing this is we reset it. And you can try it again, or you can at least just know how to reset it at least. Inside of config, we would find all your files, which is your .cfg files and a couple of .dat files and a text file, which you don't worry about that one. But basically, we delete all of these files. I'm not going to do that here today because I don't have the issue. But delete all these files, and that should clear your issue with Steam. Now, to find this location for Mac users or to not have to dig deep into the file systems of your computer, you can simply launch OOTP22, go to settings on the main menu if your game launches, because sometimes the app framework won't let you launch the game. But if you can launch the game, but it's giving you a framework error message or even an error message that it can't locate the original data files or something to uh, the something akin to it cannot uh, have permissions to write to your saved games, you can simply come to this uh, settings window from the main menu and then click the open folder containing file app.cfg and engine.cfg. And this will ask you, of course, that you're going to open up a place that normally most people won't go to, but that'll open up to the exact same location we just were at. And again, if you delete all of these, any custom work you've tried to apply to your game that is causing that issue, which is the case for most people, um, will be cleared, and it will reset back to the defaults. If you still have the issue, send us a ticket in the system. Uh, you can do that at tickets at ootpdevelopments.com, or no, sorry, support at ootpdevelopments.com. Send us a ticket. You can also do that online. Um, our website has our support links there as well, and uh, we'll be in touch to be able to help you out with that issue. Thanks.